thanks for talking to us. Now, it's been a while since you've been part of the England Lionesses squad. How good does it feel to be back? Oh, it's just uh, an incredible feeling. I think whenever you get to put the jersey on, uh, it's just uh, an amazing time as a player. So I'm glad to be back fit and uh, hopefully I can be a big part of this team winning games. England, of course, reigning champions of the She Believes Cup. Do you believe you retain <laughs> that trophy? And do I it do again? believe, yeah. I mean, it'll be a, a tough ask. A again, I think whenever you win something, it's always harder the second time round. But, you know, um, we're in a great place now as a national team and, and developing. So. It's exciting times for us and the girls did a fantastic job the last time so I'm sure that um, they can take that experience again for this one. There's quite a few new faces in the squad, it's, it's really looking to build the future, that must be really exciting to be part of. Yeah, I think Phil's got um, you know, the time leading up to Euros 2021 to um, experiment and bring uh, youth into the squad so it's great for, for us and as a national team I think it's exciting that we have uh, you know, a, a good strength and depth. Well, I know there are new faces in the Lionesses squad, um, but we're going to give you the opportunity to give us the dish <laughs> on all of them, okay? Yes, So right. I want to know, who is the team joker? Who's the class clown? That'd be uh, Jill Scott, it's always the easy one. Um, I'm sure she gets it all the time, yeah, but she's, she's funny with what she does, so. What kind of things does she do? Like practical jokes? Is she good at the puns? Like where's where's her humour? The, pu the puns. I would say the puns. She's she's quite rude actually. Um, so yeah, she's she's got a good first uh, time joke and things like that. So who is the best dancer on the team? That's not Jill. <laughs> uh, the best dancer, probably Nikita Paris. Yeah, she's she's not scared to have a dance and. Uh, She's normally in the changing room, the first one there dancing. Has she got a signature move? Is she like, you know, queen of the floss? Can she do a worm? Has she got a signature move? No, or is she no just one's that, uh, out there really with their moves. She's just got rhythm. Not, <laughs> not many of the girls have rhythm, so it's not, it's not a hard one to beat. You can't have rhythm and be playing football <laughs> no. internationally. It's just not fair. You've got to go one route or the other. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Um, who is the teacher's pet? Who's always first at training? Who's always trying to please Phil? Oh. I'd probably have to say Steph, but it's a bit harsh when she's captain, but... You can throw her under the she, bus. I've had to throw her under the bus, haven't I? Yeah, I'd probably say Steph. She's, uh, I'll say it's, she's the professional, wants to be, yeah, doing everything right. I wouldn't feel bad about it because a little while ago we did some film with her and asked her who her favourite manager was and she said, sorry, Phil, it's got to be Pep Guardiola. So you can throw her under the bus, it's fine. Um, you forget your boots to training or to a match. Which of your teammates is stepping up and lending you a pair? Ooh, uh, most of the girls probably. Um, I'd say Lucy Bronze. She, she'd definitely give me a pair of boots, yeah. She's a good egg. OK, you've got yourself into some sort of trouble. Nothing illegal, but you're in <laughs> trouble. Who are you calling to help you out? I'd probably call Demi. She's just quite level-headed and I think she'd know what to say and do for me, yeah. I would call Demi. Okay, she's the fixer in the She's the, yeah, she would fix it somehow. Now, I know everyone loves a selfie. Everyone's all over the social media, but who is the selfie queen in that England dressing room? I was going to say Tony Duggan, maybe. She's come to mind, so I've maybe seen her take one at some point. Tony likes a selfie, a bit of a picture. Um, who is, and this is a difficult question because you're all elite athletes, so by very nature you are competitive people, but who is the most competitive liner? Uh, that's Lucy Bronze. Yeah, no she's, we are very competitive, I think, a lot of us, but um, we were even on holiday one time, we were playing this beanbag game, and uh, even then, you know, Lucy wants to win, so uh, she's pretty up there, although I have been told I'm quite competitive, so maybe I've... I could also throw myself under the bus with that one. You just turned the question of who's most competitive into the competition. <laughs> yeah, into I am. <laughs> that was very, very skillful. Jordan, thank you so much. Thanks very Good much. Good luck out of the States and She Believes Cup. We'll be cheering you on back at home. Thank you. Thanks very much.